you doing? Pretending to shoot me? <laughs> you crazy fuck. <laughs> I get it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You got me. Uh, you really had me going there for a second. Man, you are just like Krubus. Always pranking. Ah, uh, fun stuff. Why the fuck are you still here? God, I am so sorry for freaking out like that. I'm just, I'm getting a little tense. You know, when you kind of had a little bit too much spurgle and your bones hurt. <laughs> yeah, I have bones. Shocker. Look, I'm not gonna lie to you, I'm totally fucking jonesing over here. Alright, okay, we got a warp device. Okay, don't um, my you know, that's gonna be helpful. Why don't we use it to cross this river so we can go talk to the Moplets and check in with them? Okay, yeah, uh, bye, I guess. Jesus. Looks like they're working on fixing this portal. You know, hey, maybe we can use it later, you know? Okay, uh, let's use this warp device Ranchy gave us to cross the river, huh? Hey there, it's me, Sudo. I'm back. Uh, looks like you're trying to use that new warp device you just got. You want me to help you out? archives. Even AI can jack off. Shit, nice work. You know, we can use this base as a bridge. Savior has 
returned. Hey, calm down. We don't need to shoot everybody. Was the man in the mansion? R Ranchy? Yeah, that guy has serious problems, but he gave us this warp device. By the gods, you've done it! You got the warp device! This might actually work. You continue to provide us with hope, Grand Savior. With this warp device, you can warp Krubus directly to you. How fortuitous! But alas, you'll need his coordinates and a blank warp disk to encode them onto. Hmm. Oh well, no way you're getting those. That stuff's in the mines. We could just go down there and get it right now. Oh right. Take this access code and head down to the mines. Everything you need is there. Okay, perfect. Thank you. You know, you, you guys figured out that whole plan for us. You know, that really means a lot. You know, it clears things up for, for us, you know, anyway. Yep, uh, we'll, we'll get it done. Get in. Nice. Geez, are the G3 even trying to domesticate the local mites? Maybe they'll sort this out themselves. I'm gonna recycle your red peppers. I'm gonna give you the Die, you creepy crawly bastard!
Yep, the G3 mines must be around here. There you go, that's the G3 for you, ruining every fucking thing they touch. Not that I like this place anyway. Oh yeah, more cannon fodder. Rip them to shreds. Gretons, get rid of them quicker, they're gonna heal the other guy. Well, I'd rather deal with these guys than that annoying before.
Gotta be honest, uh, you know, they're, they're working for the G3, but still better than our friend from earlier.
Are you feeling it? I'm feeling it! We've got this! Alright, don't forget, we're looking for a blank warp ticket and some way to find out where Krubus is. Let's get to work! Oh, this why, why would you go on to hide and seek? Uh, first one to find me wins! Attention, mining operation 12C. It's me, Krubus. Speed things up! I'm fucking underwater here trying to keep things on schedule. And I figured, maybe you forgot that if you piss me off, I will kill you. It's really easy to find more slaves. So just do your job and mine more Fergos. Krubus out. Holy shit, hey, he's got a Gatlian. We gotta rescue it.
your first question. I don't know, Merle. <laughs> Maybe it's because we work in an office and don't ask for fucking headshots with our Uh, excuse me? <sighs> I've gotta go. We'll talk more later. Bye, Merle. I'm so sorry. I didn't see you there. I'm Helen. I just need to know, are you the new hire or the new boss? new boss do i look like a wage slave to you let me in i'm ready to boss people around wow impressive i'm inspired already head on through those doors and don't be afraid to get tough these new guys really need some strong leadership up you maggots sweezy's the new boss in town and you all gotta do what i say i'm gonna whip your shit into shape any questions no ma'am no 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 ma'am uh we were just filing paperwork oh just just tell us what you want us to do ma'am kiss each other on the mouths what the fuck you want us to kiss each other yeah on the fucking mouths with tongue i actually can't do this because i'm um i'm married that's a shame i always thought you were really hot yeah, me too. Oh my god, whoa, do you, do you mean it? Of course! Look at you! Have you even seen your ass? You have a perfect ass, Dimitri. Thank you, yeah, I, I agree, I have a very perfect ass. Now, uh, come, come over here. Alright, that's enough. Really hot stuff, but enough. Now, what's next? Emails! Lots and lots of fucking emails! Oh, yeah, wait. What are the emails supposed to be about? No questions! Just send emails! Anything! To anyone! Okay, yeah, you know, I just emailed my mom and I told her I hate her. Oh, yes! Perfect work, Dimitri! Everyone, follow Dimitri's lead! Uh, okay, okay, I just sent one to my childhood sweetheart. She replied. She said she misses me too. Fuck yes! Let's keep those emails flowing! I'm sending! Wow, this oh, this feels amazing. We've never been this efficient. Okay, now stop! No more emails! <laughs> you got it, ma'am. What should we do now? Murder each other. Huh? But... No buts! Come on, I'm the boss. You have to do exactly what I say or else. Come on, we're, we're not gonna kill each other. That's crazy. That's it. I'm gonna say it. No, don't. I am. Here we go! You're a bad boss! Whoa! Where'd that come from? I'll do it. I'll kill the other two. No problem. There we go! Dimitri, I love your energy! Huh? Jeez! Come on, Dimitri! Have some pride! You don't have to do this! Sorry. Yeah, I won't do it, actually. No, fuck this! You have to! You have to kill each other because I'm the boss! Oh, yeah? Well, we quit! We're quitting right now! All of us! Right, guys? Not just me. Wait, hold on. I, I don't know about this. Dimitri. Um, yeah, okay, fine. I, I quit too. Do you never at all? Well, shit. I, uh, I guess I got a little carried away there. There's a lesson for everyone that just happened. Glad we all got to experience that. Anyway, it's all done now. I'm done being the boss. Let's see if there's anything around here about Grubus. Grumus, where are you? This is Garmantuous. I just checked the log and you're three days behind schedule with the latest shipment. But you know what? It's not that big of a fucking deal. These Fergals aren't gonna be worth shit now that we discovered humans. Might even have to shut this whole operation down just to get all hands on deck over on Earth. I'd give your territory to the Scrandle Brothers and have them expand their facilities to find out more about these humans. Oh, have you tried one of these fuckers yet? Oh, God, the high? It's otherworldly. Can't believe a species like this really exists! Humans! <laughs> Who'd have even thought? Anyway, don't fuck up again, even if it doesn't matter, or I'll smoke you myself. Here we go, fucking bingo! This idiot left the paper trail. 
Borday the 12th. That's the day. We fucking got him. Okay, so what? We just need the blank warp disk now? Easy peasy. for the bad guys, okay? Uh, we keep asking them to get a canary in case we hit a vein of carbon monoxide. You know, us moplets can breathe carbon monoxide, so we'd be fine. Mining Operation 12C. This is Krubus again. One of you weird moplet fucks just- well, I don't want to die like this, or, or, or at all. Trouble. No, no, it's okay. We're oh. friends. We, we hate the G3 too. Oh, wonderful. Thank God. <clears throat> so, what's your plan? We have started our resistance. Not only do the G3 enslave us, but they have desecrated oh. our holiest of sites and absconded with our sweet prince. Prince Chosen One. That's, that's him. Prince oh, one. that's awful. So, so you kidnapped this G3 merc as a bargaining chip to get your prince back? Oh. Hmm. Okay, yeah, that's smart. No, we, we didn't think of that at all. But it's fine, we know where the prince is. They swapped him out with the rest of our sacred grounds when they warped in a new base. So you want us to go clear it out and then warp the throne room back? Oh, heavens! Would you really do all that for us? The base is just past this tunnel. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Is his name really Prince Chosen One? Yes! Oh! He was named as such according to the prophecy. And then after that, it was made into a prince. So you trust your leaders to prophecies. Is he a good prince? Well, the prophecy doesn't guarantee he's going to be good at his job. It just tells us who to pick. Look, I, 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 I don't know. I don't know. Look, now is not the time to criticize us. We're, I'm just, you know, we're distressed as it is. I'm just doing my job. <laughs> Listen, we're looking for a blank warp disk. Do, do you have any ideas? Ah, yes. Our prince has a stash of them. Really? All you need to do is clear out the warp base the G3 plopped out in our holy land. Then you'll reclaim the sacred grounds and rescue Prince Chosen One. And then he'll give us a blank disk? Yes, oh yes. We, we can help each other. Oh, what a fortuitous happenstance. Oh. All right, we are off. I'm back! <laughs> wow, you know, we, we're about to rescue a prince. You know, I'm, I'm a little nervous. You know, I, I hope he lives up to the hype. Hey, listen, when has a prince ever let anyone down? You know what I mean? 
Oh shit, this must be the place. Okay, let's clear it out. disc in here. Let's head back outside and use this to reverse the warp. What? 
I'm fine. Look, we were told you had some sort of blank warp disk. Huh? Yeah, 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 sure. I've got a bunch. Okay, we got everything we need. Let's get back to Ranchy's place and see if he, you know, can help us encode them onto this machine. Fritz chosen one has returned. All has been restored. Prince Chosen One, I am so sorry, but we're out of place. Can I interfere? for Krubus' base. I do appreciate 
appreciate the break, you know, it's all paperwork. It's definitely day in and day out, but I want you to fuck. <laughs> no, I'm not gonna let you fucking kill me. Just a little Virgo to help get my energy back up. How are we doing? You know, we're pretty new to this, so for beating you, you should be really embarrassed. up there, wasn't I? Sorry about that. Ooh. Hey, bud, the name's Gus. Feel good to meet you. Look at you, man. Pretty slick taking out Krubus like that, rescuing me from indentured servitude, etc., etc. I love that kind of stuff. You know what? I love that. That's the kind of stuff I love, man. Do you mind if I tag along with you for a bit? I, of course. I, I, that's what I was hoping you'd say. We can use your help. But I should be clear that we are trying to take down the whole G3 cartel, and we might die. Music to my ears. You think I don't want to take down the cartel? But that's all I want to do. That's all I dream about. Amazing. God, I'm so glad to find another Catlian alive and well. I love your tiny little hands, by the way. I, I, I had a cousin who had those tiny hands. He died in the zombie apocalypse on Gatlas. But, you know, look, I'm sure you don't want to hear about that. We had to live through it. I mean, you know what? Who wants to talk about that? Here's what I do. I shoot this, right? They still the certain walls, and you can climb with them. Let me show off my disc launching trick on that leg. See, 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 that's what I'm talking about. Now climb up there. Aren't you glad you met me? Oh, shit. Time to fight. Oh, oh okay. this guy. Pretty chill, right? Use that whenever you want. It's cool. <laughs> and I see another wall you can climb. You see that, right? Hmm. Still a little far away. I'm not sure you can jump to that. Do I have to do fucking everything? Combo time. Use me to tether over to that desk. Definitely gonna die in this shit.
of the pit I really built for you. Time's up, motherfuckers. What's up, bounty hunter? How you like grenades? Something you should see. Take a look after you turn in your bounty. Could you turn your micro rockets in, please? Yeah, and who's that green fella you got there? What's up? I'm Gus. He's an it's good to meet you. That's room 203 down the hall. Okay, thank you. Come on. I said, what's up? Check this out. Hello, Blim City citizens. That's Club Nugman, Blim City Magistrate. As you all know, I'm working hard to flush out all the crime and drugs from our streets. I'll be the first to admit, we haven't made much headway in the fight against the G3 cartel. All right, all right. Now catch this next bit. All about to change. We've learned of a bold bounty hunter who's been bravely taking this G3 matter into their own hands. You hear that? He's talking about you! They've already dealt with two of the cartel's most powerful officers. Yeah, you got lucky. I am not too proud to ask for help in our war on drugs. Bounty Hunter, if you're listening, please consider joining forces with the good people of Blim City. I hope you'll choose to come forward and meet with me personally at my office in City Hall. I mean, we might as well hear them out, right? I already told him you go. Without even asking us first? No, don't start. Trust me, he's legit. This guy's been anti-G3 since before any of you were even in diapers. Honestly, I don't know if Gatlin's even wear diapers. Just head through there. Clug's expecting you. Thank you so much for coming, Bounty Hunter. Our pleasure. Nice view you got up here. Look, I'll cut to the chase. I need your help. You're a human, correct? My men looked into it. Sorry. You survived the G3's attack on your home planet Earth, right? Yeah, they're a human. Where Gatlin is. Of course. Sorry. I'm familiar with your plight as well. It's such a tragedy what happened on Gatlas. It makes much sense that you and the human would join forces, but perhaps you have room for one more ally as well? <laughs> a lawless bounty hunter teaming up with a squeaky clean politician. <laughs> really? That's precisely why I need your help. I'm having the darndest time curbing the species drug trade. I can only do so much, and only within the confines of the law. I mean, I've got my hands full with Gary the Poisoner. He's not just poisoning the water supply, he's moved on to poisoning weirder stuff now, like street lamps. We don't even know how that works, or if it's actually a problem. Maybe it's fine to poison street lamps. I'm a bit overwhelmed, and I wish I could focus more time on the G3. But you... You've taken out two top G3 officers in less time than it takes us to file a single report. So you see how you can help me, but there's also one way I can help you. Go on, let me take it all in. This tool on my desk here will help you rescue your fellow humans. You can use it to teleport them to a safe haven my team has arranged for them to stay at until the G3 are dealt with. Take a look at this tool!
me get this straight. You're giving this to us for free. Well, the human species is technically a drug. I can't have dangerous sentient drugs in the hands of my citizens, and you can't have your people getting captured and consumed. This solves both of our problems. Assuming you plan to continue taking out the G3. That's right. Then, thank you. Sincerely, you humans and Gatlians, you're both very noble species. This means a lot to me. I've made it my life's work to use my power to help people in need, but even I have my limits. I'm just glad I have someone like you to turn to. As a token of thanks, my team will be feeding any intel we find on the G3 directly to your handler, Mr. Zaruthian. We've already sent him everything we had. The rest is in your hands. We appreciate that, pal. If it's okay if I call you pal. That's all I have for you. Feel free to stay as long as you like. The view is breathtaking. Oh, uh, feel free to stay as long as you'd like. You can visit the human haven yourself, by the way. We don't know exactly what makes humans comfortable, but I hope you like how we've set things up. Look at us! And we're back! So... <laughs> It went well, huh? I got a message saying they'll hook us up with any G3 intel they find. Yeah, and he hooked us up with a way to save humans! God damn. You got it easy. Nothing as convenient as this ever happened when I was bounty hunting. Hey, uh, speaking of, we should get you a jetpack before you head back out into the field. You're really gonna need it. Head on down to the pawn shop and see if they got one in stock. Oh, and yeah, you might want to hit up Bordeaux's chef stand, too. It's a little shady, but uh, those warp discs he's selling can be pretty helpful. Oh my god. What did he do to you? What did he do to you? Oh, I'm okay. Hmm. So this is where the magic happens, huh? trying to get our attention. Here's what's up. My name's Stan, and I sell vials of alien cum. I know that's probably not what you wanted to hear when you walked over here. You wanted cum or what? Sure, okay, give us the cum. Wow, you just went right for it. Didn't even ask any questions. <laughs> Didn't even ask how much it cost. <laughs> I knew I was right about you. I knew you loved alien cum. Well, here, have this alien cum on the house. Just tell all your friends about me. Say Stan has the absolute best alien cum I've ever seen, tasted, touched, whatever. I'm not sure if it's his or if he's getting it from some other alien, but I'm just such a huge fan of his work and what he's doing out there on the streets of Glam City selling alien cum to the community. Say all of that. Nope, I don't want this blood on my hands. What is your fucking deal? We're not killing them. Stop it, we're not killing this one. Hey, you got any uh, jetpacks in stock? A jetpack? Oh, certainly. I can help. Uh, I can help.
Ah, uh, jetpack, huh? Great choice. Really phenomenal choice. Let's lock that purchase in. Nice. Don't we get a jetpack now? Not so fast. I gotta back order that bad boy. I'll have it ready for you in a couple of days, I promise. No refunds, by the way. This purchase is final. Oh, way to rip us off. Guess we'll wait. Not like we have a choice. Let's go tell Jean. Have a nice day. Hey, it's been a while, Bounty Hunter. Hey, watch where you're going. I need it. Calm down, we don't need to shoot everybody. How'd it go? Did you get a jetpack? Yeah, but it's on back order. Great. Perfect excuse for a rest. We're still waiting on Clug's intel anyway. Why don't you go to bed and sleep off some of that excitement? Gene's right. That, that's, that sounds like a good idea. So this is your bedroom, huh? It, hey, good night, partner. I'm just gonna sit right here and watch you fall asleep. I'm really glad we met. You know, I, I think I think we're doing something amazing here. How cool would it be if we actually stopped the G3? Sorry, sorry, I, 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 I'm just, I'm excited. I'll shut up, L let's get some sleep. Pretty soon, you know, we'll be jetpacking across all the space. Sorry, I'm, I'm being too loud. You're probably trying to, let's get you to sleep. Let's take this jetpack for a spin. Can you make it over that gap? We're like a goddamn. Holy shit, this rules! Whoops! Uh, maybe let's try that again. Holy shit, this rules! Oh, check out that landing. Goddamn! But nothing about this show is good, so, uh, don't know why you would have expected it to be good. Just gonna stand here for a little bit, and uh, you know it's not a, it's not good, it's not entertaining to watch, but it's uh, it's right there on the the tin. It's the bad TV show, not a good one. Okay, um, maybe next I'll just sort of not talk for a little bit. No, whoa, whoa, whoa. When I uh, maybe let's try that again. I'm just gonna do it anyway. And you know we gotta wrap. Long, it starts getting into that like anti comedy thing and actually becomes good. So, you know, we're probably gonna end the show pretty soon. So, don't, uh, don't start raving here, friend. Nice! tell you gene was right that is gonna come in handy it's also fun you could fly while doing combat it's a very cool uh feature that we have here we put a lot of time and effort into it let's head back and talk to gene and see if there's any new bounties i may make the world be happy but i can't hide the truth for myself whatever happens i must go on acting 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 be a polyotola <laughs> I've been telling you to clean up. This place is a mess. I need you to clean it up before tweaking. 
gets here. Oh, got a big date with your sad sack Flimborg boy toy? Fuck off, Gene, like you've even never been on a date. Hey, don't even start, sister. I know a lot about dates. I fucked more aliens than your brain could comprehend. And even I don't want to touch your boyfriend. So sick of hearing about this guy. Yeah, right. My boyfriend is so fucking hot though, right? Oh, come on. You haven't even seen him. Why'd you answer that? Trust me. You don't have to support her just because she's family. This guy's a loser. He is so hot. He's like a low seven or a high six. And he's really nice to me. Yeah, no ulterior motives there. Just clean up after yourself, Jesus. Hey, look, I'm sorry if I'm coming off harsh. He's messing up the group dynamic. We've got a good thing going here. We do that fun sitcom banter back and forth while your nibbling here goes and blasts alien baddies in the face. It's great! Dude, you're lucky you even get to live here with us. I don't care about your damn dynamics. I'm just saying you barely know this guy. Are you sure you're even attracted to him? Most aliens only bang their own species. Oh, what about you? You just said you've slept with basically everything in the whole galaxy. Yeah, but I'm a washed up degenerate. You got your whole life ahead of you. That's more condescending than it is sweet. What? No, uh, look, we've spent all this time living together. I, I care about you now, Leslie. For fuck's sake, my name's Lizzie. Come on, tell her I care about her. It's literally two options. Just flip a coin or something if it's that hard. What are you waiting for? You gonna make up your mind? Just say something. Why does everything take you so long? Why are you taking so long? What? Did you go mute all of a sudden? Yeah. I guess you don't talk that much. This ain't a test. Just trust your gut. Are you really this indecisive? Just choose something.
We're all living under the same roof. And that makes us family. And it makes her business my business. I'm the man of the house. So she needs to do what I say. And before anyone accuses me of being a misogynist, yeah, I know I'm a misogynist. We all know I'm a misogynist. That's bad. And I'm working on it. But this is about me being right and your sister being wrong. Listen to yourself. I can make my own decisions. I don't know why you think you're suddenly some father figure to me just because you're crashing on my couch and eating my diary. Oh yeah, I said eating. He's been eating pages out of my diary. So what? My species eats paper. It's delicious. Who gives a shit? I'm so sick of this shit. Look, I just don't want Twig to think I'm messy, okay? It's that simple. And I don't want you dating him at all. Why don't I set you up with my nephew, Grimble Dick? He's got a steady job. And yes, before you ask, he's got both his legs. That's not like a family ailment or anything. Fuck off! Just grow up and get used to me and Twig! Come on, tell Jean I can date whoever I want. Well, geez. I don't know why you're being so critical of me. I mean, I'm your own sister, and I'm the only human you've got left that's not getting smoked by giant space slugs. Wow. Yeah, uh, she's right. Real cold of you. Just kidding. She's wrong and you made the right choice. Just clean up, Jean, okay? Sorry to drag you into all that. Anyway, a nice little arrangement with Clug is paying off. They sent us intel on two new bounties. So, uh, go ahead if you want to get started on those. And Jill came tumbling after. 